Hey guys, so this is my emergency kit and a water bottle. Uh, the water bottle is a clean canteen, one liter stainless steel, so you can cook in it if you need to. And I just put a little carabiner on the top here. So let's see what's inside. Alright, so to start off with, uh, I got one of those little reflective wristbands that will slap on there. Uh, I've also got a plastic bag. You never know when you need a bag. Uh, and then also, this might be a little random, but um, you know, I've also got some earplugs in here in case I just need to muffle out some noise. Uh, I've also got a um, pencil sharpener. Uh, this I was thinking of trying to use it to get uh, shavings or you know, little tiny pieces of wood. So you can just take your twig and get it in, twist it in here. Um, and you've got some kindling, some little shavings for you. And also, I have things a little packed in here. <laughs> uh, I've also got a crank flashlight, really cheap on Amazon. I got two of them for like six bucks. Basically, it's got three bulbs, but one of, you've got two settings uh, for one bulb and then three bulbs. Let's see. And then uh, I've also got chapstick. I never go anywhere without chapstick. Uh, I went with this one um, because this type of container. Because this is going to be sitting in my truck most of the time, uh, especially when on hot days, this won't uh, leak on you. Um, and I, I just don't like that. <laughs> uh, okay, so then also, I've always got to have a little bit of meat, a little bit of food. So I've got two sticks of beef jerky. Uh, and then also, this is a, uh, a fish mouth spreader, spring loaded. Uh, why do I have it in here? Um, well, it's basically to be able to hold um, my water bottle. So it sits on here and it locks into place on the lip on the inside. Uh, so that way I can just run a string or over a piece of stick in this loop and then I can just hang, hang it over my fire instead of having to sit it down into it. So that's why I've got that. Alright, and then I've got also get some things out of here first. Alright, so this is a uh, $10 multi-tool. Um, it's got on this side a knife, a screwdriver, and a file. Uh, and then on the other side, another knife. Um, I think it's a saw. Yeah, and a little pick. And then uh, this turns into a spring-loaded pair of pliers. Um, so yeah, it fits in there. It's really nice. And then, yeah, this might be a little random, um, but this is just basically a collapsible can opener. Um, it came with two when I found it on Amazon for like three bucks or you know, maybe that. Um, so I just figured I would have one in here just in case. You never know if I run into, run across a can of beans or some meat uh, somewhere. You know, I always need to have a way to open it. And then I'm trying to find the other set for this, but basically I've got the water treatment tablets. Uh, that I picked up from um, Walmart. Yeah, here's the other piece of it. So you got the two bottles. Uh, and then also I've got a, a way to start fire. Uh, this is the Bear Grylls uh, Striker. And uh, you talk about throwing sparks. This thing does it. I don't know if many people are familiar with this, but yeah, get it. If you want a nice spark thrower, uh, this thing is amazing. I mean, look at that. That's crazy. I didn't even press hard. Uh, and then also a nice little advantage that this comes with a whistle in case you need to cry for help. <laughs> All right, and then let's see what else. Got two types of cordage. Um, the, both of these are about 50 feet each. And then the big, the big thing that takes up the most space is my emergency blanket. Um, it fits in there as well. Uh, it's the Survive Outdoor Longer. Um, that's what the SOO stands for, not the other thing. Um, and then this is basically a survival blanket big enough for two. And on the outside of the blanket is uh, instructions for different tarp setups that's here on the back and then also some random survival instructions as well. Um, so yeah, let me see if I can spread this stuff out a little bit more and let you guys see it. But um, this is basically all the stuff that uh, will fit inside of this and that's my water uh, bottle emergency kit. So if you guys have any comments, suggestions, recommendations, uh, or concerns, um, just definitely let me know. 
uh, please write them below the in the comment section. I'm definitely open to any and all advice. So, hope you guys are doing well.